Good morning, everyone. It's Elsa the Bargain Hunter here. I started the morning by going to the post office and sending out my two entries. So Kathy at Kathy's Favorite Things and Trina at Trina's Place. Your packages, my entries to your challenges have been mailed out. Uh, hopefully there'll be no delays in the post office because they're saying Monday. So we'll see. Um, next to the post office was Dollar General. And as I mentioned yesterday, I have forgotten the um, parchment paper along with some other things. So I just ran over to Dollar General. I actually parked right in front of them. So I went over there and um, grabbed the parchment paper and the little bit of things that I needed. I was proud of myself, walked in, got what I needed, walked out. <laughs> but that was without, uh, that wasn't without going by the clearance section in case they, I missed something, but I didn't. I got everything I needed. So guys, here I am attempting to make my enamel dots. And um, the oven has already been preheated to 450. And I'm going to put them in there now. Wish me luck. I hope there's not too many. I hope they don't buying together i see more than what you guys have been putting but um i don't know we'll see um i'll be back in five minutes guys bye hey guys they're still in the oven but i don't know if you guys can see i just wanted to share this with you guys the smoke coming out of there sorry about the pot it's a very old pot but the smoke coming out of the oven <laughs> now it's a deal did say that there will be a strong odor because you are melting plastic. But it's not that bad so far. And it's only been about a, two minutes probably. So, yeah. Just wanted to share that part. I'll be back. <laughs> Alright guys, I'm back. This is what they look like melted. I just took them out. So, um, they are different sizes. I guess some melted faster than others. As you can see, that purple one is really tiny, which is fine with me. And some of them melted all the way. And the purple ones are the ones acting up. Look at that one. A little bubbly there. So the purple ones seem to be my challenge. <laughs> that one's getting very smoky. But I'm wondering if that's because this is a new oven. Because it's clean. It's a very clean oven. I mean, the stove stop like that every day. But I hardly um, been thinking about it. This is an electric stove, and I try not to use too much of the electricity, you know, bill-wise. want the bill to get up too high. But um, I hardly use the oven, so I'm wondering if that's why it was so smoky. Take a look outside, guys. Snowing. It was snowing a couple of days ago. This is what's left over. But um, it's supposed to rain tonight, so we'll see. So I'm just going to let these cool down, guys. I'll be back. Okay, guys. This is what I got. Um, it kind of stuck to the paper. Maybe I used paper on the wrong side. I don't know. But it did kind of stick to the paper. As you can see on that one. There's some, um, residue, I guess you call it, from the paper. But that's what it came out like. I like them. And I like that they all came out in different sizes. That's perfect. In my next attempt, I'm going to try to sort out the colors. I don't know, just to make it easier to keep them separated. I'm wondering if these beads come in more vibrant colors. These look like more pastel. So I'm going to be on the search. Let me know because I, I, I really don't look for the beads, so I don't know what's out there. I only found this pack which the, with the pastel colors. So let me know if there's any brighter colors out there, more vibrant. I would love to get those. Funny how I only got one red. <laughs> Is that even red or is that pink? That's a darker pink. But yeah, guys, let me know if there's another option for the beads as far as colors. I love these, especially with Easter coming. But if I'm going to do these, I want to get them all, you know. And I'm using right now the little um containers. Hold on. I'm using these little, uh, come on, here we go. I'm using the magnetic containers from Dollar Tree, the two in a pack. So, um... Just to store them for now. Like I said, I'm going to try to get separate them. It's going to be more time consuming. But I have nothing but time on my hands when I'm not recording. So we'll see. Guys, hope you like this. Enjoy it. And um, I'm going to attach It's a Deals link once again in my description box. In case you guys want to see. But the setting uh, was 450 in the oven. Separate them. 
as you guys had seen that I had done, they didn't stick to each other, which is good. Thought maybe I put too many in them, but I guess I didn't. And um, I checked them five minutes once they were after five minutes once they were in the oven, and this is what they came out with. It takes a couple of minutes to cool down, and I have the fan, the ceiling fan on, so that made it cool down even faster. All right, guys. Hope you guys like this. Let me know in the comments if there is um, another bag of beads, like the more vibrant colors. These seem to be more pastel. Alright guys, talk to you guys later. Bye.